Okay, guys, I'm back for part two. It's May 27, 2023. Um, I claim that Jesus Christ is Son of God. He's also God. He came to earth as a man in the flesh, bled on the cross, and rose on the third day. He's born of a virgin. He died for our sins. Um, ignore the telegram and the WhatsApp people because they're trying to scam you. Um, you know, before I get to the part two, I just want to say, you know, the Lord revealed his plan to me for all the people that come on my page and say I'm a false prophet. Um, <clears throat> first of all, we're not even on man's calendar, but it was genius what, G what Jesus did because, guys, it went viral. The messages went viral. Haven't you ever heard bad publicity is good publicity? So I had to take the fall for Jesus, but you know what? It's not about me, so it doesn't matter. I'll, I'm willing to take the slack and, you know, all the terrible things people say about me for Jesus. <clears throat> but you guys are going to regret your words. And Jesus said, you're about to see his glory. And you know what? It's amazing because, guys, I don't know if you know this, <laughs> but so many people have come against me. And then God spoke to them or gave them a dream or woke them up and basically put on their heart that they were persecuting an anointed person, not just me, but his other anointed people as well. <clears throat> and they came and apologized. So be careful what you say, guys, words will condemn you. And you know, if you believe in Jesus, you'll lose your rewards in heaven, you know, because every word you speak, you know, is life or death. And you should always come with love and correction. If you don't agree with something, that's fine. You don't have to listen, but you don't have to come on someone's page and mock them and ridicule them either. God is getting very angry, and I am not the only person he's speaking to right now about it. He's speaking to many prophets about the same thing, about how he's tired of people persecuting the chosen ones that he picked for this appointed time. And just because you didn't get a position to speak or a prophet does not mean you're not chosen. You know, he knows your heart. <clears throat> so if you believe in Jesus 100% and you rely on him to save you, you're chosen. You're the Philadelphia church. So don't let Satan lie to you. <laughs> okay, let me get to the message. <clears throat> Luke 3, 8. Therefore bear fruits worthy of repentance and do not begin to say to yourselves, we have Abraham as our father. For I say to you that God is able to raise up children to Abraham, excuse me, from these stones. Here's a message. Your window, you have a small window of opportunity, a small window to believe. Time to make a choice, children. You can't serve me and bow. If you forgive your neighbor, I will forgive you. Forgiveness is fruit of the spirit. Do you love your neighbor? Do you truly have my spirit? You will know by your fruits. Wake up, O oh sleeper, I'm coming to pick up my bride for the wedding feast. Put your wedding garments on. There will be a feast and dancing. You will reign in my glory forever. You can enjoy supper with the lamb if you believe in me and confess I am Lord. Give me your hearts. I want to save you. I wish for no one to perish. The end is here. The end is now. Reader, pay attention. I told you where to start. I told you the beginning and the end. I love you, your Savior, Yahshua HaMashiach, and I have spoken. Deuteronomy 14.9 These you may eat of all that are in the waters. You may eat all that have fins and scales. <clears throat> I don't know what he means by that one. Um, and I was like, okay, maybe I heard it wrong. But then he like held my hand really tight and would not let me erase it. So he means something by that. Leviticus 3.11 And the priest shall burn them on the altar's food and offering made by fire to the Lord. You know, and sometimes I've noticed, guys, uh, Jesus uses random things to prove to another believer, you know, to give them confirmation. I've noticed that. Uh, Matthew 24, 8. All these are the beginning of sorrows. Luke 13, 7. Then he said to the keeper of his vineyard, Look, for three years I have come seeking fruit on this fig tree and find none. Cut it down. Why does it use up the ground? James 3, 8, but no man can tame the tongue. It is unruly, evil, full of deadly poison. Exodus 21, 6, <clears throat> then his master shall bring him to the judges. He shall also bring him to the door. 
or to the doorpost, and his master shall pierce his ear with an awl, and he shall serve him forever. Ezekiel 9.11 <clears throat> Just then the man clothed with linen, who had the inkhorn at his side, reported back and said, I have done as you commanded me. Isaiah 18.3 all inhabitants of the world and dwellers on the earth, when he lifts up a banner on the mountains, you see it. And when he blows a trumpet, you hear it. Psalm 16, 5. O Lord, you are the portion of my inheritance and my cup. You maintain my lot. Daniel 12, 8. Although I heard, I did not understand. Then I said, my Lord, what shall be the end of these things? <clears throat> okay, guys, that was it. That was the message. Um... I don't know what Jesus is doing. <laughs> Guys, like I say, we prophesy in part. I do know his plan. He told me that he's sorting out the wheat and the tares in a message the other day. And I don't know how long that takes. I don't know how long we're going to be on the boat or if we're on the boat. I just know that was a warning to get on the boat. Because <clears throat> in previous messages, he said, sink or swim. It's amazing because, you know, he told me, I don't know what, three weeks ago that there's going to be high winds. And now, according to the weather, there's, like, going to be high winds everywhere. And trees are falling down and all that stuff. I know my electricity, like, blinked five times tonight. And um, I think there was, like, an outage in my neighborhood. The winds were really strong. Um, <clears throat> and I heard North Dakota is getting some things. And that was definitely one of the messages. So, guys, I am just being obedient. I love Jesus with all my heart. So, before you judge me, just, just go to Jesus. That's all I ask you to do. I promise you, if you go to Jesus with all of your heart, he will reveal what his plans are. Guys, he has no favorites. He has no favorites. He gives people different gifts. And, you know, you just have to examine your hearts, just like Jesus said. And guys, seek him first. You know, don't, don't let anything um, in this world, including these videos, take you away from Jesus' time. You know, always make him first on everything, okay? All right, guys. I love you very much. And um, <clears throat> if I see you tomorrow, I will see you tomorrow. It all, it all depends on what Jesus wants to do. Okay. God bless. Did I say ignore the Telegram and the WhatsApp people? I can't remember. Just in case. Ignore them. They're scamming you. Okay. God bless.